Good morning, friends. How are you today? I am so excited to see you. Are you ready to start our morning together? All right, stand up and let's say the Pledge of Allegiance together. Left hand by your side, right hand over your heart. Ready, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Incredible, my friends. Go ahead and take a seat. Does anyone remember what month we're in? Remember, we started a new month. Do you remember what that month is called? We'll figure it out together. Are you ready? So up here we see that our month starts with a J sound. And what sound does J make? J, J, J. You're exactly right. So J, um, June. We are in the month of June, which is our last month of the school year. How crazy is that, friends? Are you ready to count to see what today's date is? We don't have many numbers up there because we're just at the beginning of the month. So we have to figure out what our date is today. Are you ready? Fingers ready. One, two, three. Today is June 3rd. Let me ask you, friends. Is this a three? What about this? Is this a three? No. Is this a three? It certainly is. And we're going to go ahead and put that up next to our two. Are you ready to figure out what day of the week it is today? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Thursday, Friday, Saturday. We're going to go to the three. And we're going to climb up. And we see that today's day of the week starts with a wuh, wuh, wuh sound. What day of the week starts with a wuh, wuh, w sound? Wednesday. You're exactly right. So today is Wednesday, June 3rd, 2020. You guys are so smart. Now, what I need you to do is I need you to stand up and go look outside your window and see what the weather is like today at your house. Are you all done? Okay, come back and take a seat. What is the weather like today at your house? Really? That's awesome. At Miss Grin's house. You might notice it's pretty dark, and that's because there I cannot see the sun outside. You guys are going in for a little chill. What do we call that when we can't see the sun outside and it's covered up? Cloudy. You're exactly right. So the weather at my house today is cloudy. We're going to go ahead and put that up under our... Can anyone remind me what vowel we are learning about this week? I, you're exactly right. And what are the two different sounds that the letter I can make? It can make a short sound and it can make a long sound. Do you remember what the short sound is? You're right. I, 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 I. And we can hear that short I sound in words like I. Igloo, eh, eh, iguana, and eh, eh, insect. What's the second sound that the letter I can make? We call it the long sound. You're right. The letter I can say its name. So it can say, I, I. And we can hear that letter's name and that long sound in words like ice cream. Island and Ice Cube. Incredible. Okie dokie. Do you feel like your body needs a break? My body's feeling a little bit wiggly today. Are you ready? We are going to use our I word to pretend like we are I 
iguana. Are you ready? So, an iguana. Does an iguana ha walk on two feet? No way. They walk on all fours. And do you remember what number we are learning about this week? 13. So, do you know what we're going to do? We're going to walk around on all fours. So, that's our hands and our feet on the ground for 13 seconds. Are you ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh. Oh. Get all those wiggles out. Get all those wiggles out. Get all those wiggles out. Incredible methods. Come back and take a seat. Can anyone tell me who this is? Donald Trump. You're exactly right. And who is Donald Trump, my friends? Our president. And do you know where jo Donald Trump lives? His house is called the White House. And do you know what, where the White House is? In Washington, D.C. That's exactly right. And let me ask you a question. Is Washington, D.C. super close to us or super far away from us? You're right. Super, super close to us. It is just down the street from our school. Can anyone tell me what country we live in? The United States of America. That's exactly right. And what state do we live in? It's the small purple one all the way over here. Maryland. That's exactly right. We live in the state of Maryland. Does anyone know what state Miss Megan lives in? That's right next to us. Virginia, that's exactly right. And what's this long state over here? California. What about this one up here? Washington. Texas. Florida. Tennessee. And what state do we live in again? Maryland. You guys, so smart. So smart. So, today, we are going to review the sight word that we learned last week and we're going to learn a new sight word. Are you ready? Does anyone remember what sight word we learned last week? I'm going to show you and give you a hint. What word is this? I see a T O. T O. Two. Our sight word last week was the word two. Can everyone say two? Amazing. Our new sight word this week actually starts with the vowel we are learning about this week. This is our new sight word. What two letters do you see in our new sight word? I and N. So we know that I can make two different sounds. It can say I, 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 or it can say I. And in this case, it says I, I, I. So we're going to say I and then N. Mm and put those two sounds together. I, n, in, in. Our new sight word this week is the word in. What word is this? In. What word is this? In. You guys are so, so incredibly smart. I hope you have the most wonderful Wednesday, and I will see you.